Hey folks and fans, you're blind dyslexic. Well, excuse me, I was about to burp there. Heading home. I went till 4.30 today. I thought I was supposed to go till 5. I could have, but, but you know, I put in a good day. Zero coupons. Blah. Uh, let's see. Pretty much was trying to stock, locate stuff at 8. In other words, try, because I had the snick to take care of both stock the staging and and the takeout. It was a light day. I'm surprised. I mean, this snick hardly even made a noise. I was starting to worry that I was constantly disconnected, but it wasn't the case. I did have to switch a snick on it twice, because the room, I don't know if it was the room I was in or just the snick, which wouldn't connect right. But I did, but I might work on that uh, Batman Noir thing. I hope somebody got to look at it. Because I thought that was smooth. I mean, the way I've got that cover set up, but I think even smoother is the way I did my uh, Doctor Who book. But I'm going to promote the, death, the Batman Noir. Because like, I'm still uncertain which way to go. I've got it set up to where I got it set up to where he does return from the war, and he's fiance to a person who would naturally be a Catwoman. But I'm still uncertain which way to go with the whole funding thing. What he actually finds out. That's the only only dilemma I've got. But I do want to thank the dude who did the uh, uh, the cosplay. I'll put a I'll put a picture of the uh, I'll put a picture of the book and the guy in question as a little little icon little thumbnail so you can see but I thank that guy there for giving me the idea whoever you are smooth costume uh, of course it's not going to have Robin in it because we don't need a we don't need a sidekick They were working, they were taking care of their sweet tea when I left Firehouse, so that's why I didn't grab a drink. Uh, pretty much that's all the excitement I can think of. Dad comes next week, which is a good thing because next week is also payday. Nearly got. I hope I nearly got the day screwed up because uh, I asked for the 14th and the 16th off and I noticed I was working Friday, uh, Tuesday, which is normally a tough day. Well, I hardly ever ask for days off and I question uh, I don't want to say AJ, know where my brain is because I was chatting with AJ, another AJ, before I bounced. But, uh, Chad was Chad beforehand, and it was going to be uh, Tim and Dante. And Tim was talking to Kyle about about his curls. This is I made some crack about the curls for his hair. Is go home, funny, ha ha, go home. <laughs> and we do. We have a great time. It's actually the crew we work with that makes it good. I guess I'll flip you around. 
let you see which direction I'm not shutting I'm not going now I'm just flipping it around so you can look around uh, I can't remember if it was today or yesterday we were, they, we were talking about the whole choice between Firehouse and uh, Witch Witch one of the guys hadn't yet gone to Witch Witch yet not to say which which is good, but it was la oh, I know what it was. It was, uh, it was when I was close to my house. That's what it was. But we were debating that and says, yeah, there's Quiznos, there's Witch Witch, there's Firehouse. And, and depending on which one you go to, the food's good. That is real odd how it is. You can go to one and the food is good. You can go to another and it's like, is this the same joint? I know they got different people making it, but still you assume that the food would be somewhat similar. But yeah, there was a Quiznos that was up in Bixby that is now some sort of, I think, top hat pizza. I think they expanded too much. I think Quiznos expanded too much and that's why that one uh, finally left. But as far as I know, there's a Quizno still down there by Best Buy. And that and that, that Quizno is okay. I think that's why I hardly ever go over it. Quiznos is good. But I'm just saying, a lot of times the locations, the food is not that superb. Like, my firehouse, my wish witch, which is actually in the direction that I'm going. But, I'd have to go across the street, since it's already 8. Pen was out of, I don't know if my pen was out of ink, or it's just the, uh, the receipt in general. Uh, I did their little survey, and they gave me the number uh, to fill out at the bottom. And, so I'm going to have to... So I had to make a copy and send that that little free drink uh, offer. Uh, I had to send that little free drink offer off as a uh, as a little text to myself to remind myself to write that number down. Uh, but I'm off this Saturday. Nothing really good starts this Saturday. I mean, this Friday. It's all limited, limited stuff. So I'll probably just veg out. But Doctor Who's on. I know that. I'm just saying, at the movie joint, nothing, nothing really comes out until next week. Which I'm still depressed about that. Dad's coming next week, and and the fifteenth. Is 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 Twin Peaks's is Twin is Twin Peaks's bikini fashion show and and Chelsea Chelsea had to say Chelsea Chelsea had to say she's got that they've already got their swimsuits. I said, man, when's your next one? Next year. <laughs> Not fair. But that's what's going on. Uh, aftermath that uh, new internet, uh, new internet uh, music joint, uh, music station was taking, took over D Town. Check that out. Ah. Uh, but if I think of anything else, I'll post it or do something. If you like what you're seeing, please subscribe and leave your two cents down below. And please make a donation to Cancer at Home and Cancer Sucks. Two great charities that do a world of good for our men and women in the military and those that have cancer. And to all our men and women out there, thank you. Keep up the great job and stay safe. You're always in our hearts.
mộc mình phía gắt đáng như nó trông thét này là Bima đi này là Bima Destination Nonetheless, blind dyslexic. Ciao for now.